football mad Prince George has attended an Aston Villa match for the first time as he celebrated the team's triumph alongside Prince William, Kate Middleton and sister Charlotte. The royal family looked delighted as they cheered from the stands at their local stadium on Carrow Road on Saturday to support the Duke of Cambridge's favourite team opposing Norwich City. Prince George, 6, put on a toothless grin throughout the match while wearing the Birmingham Cubs t-shirt, before he punched the air as the team scored a goal, in what is believed to be his first ever football match. The Duke could be seen putting his arm around his eldest son as the pair relished the excitement of their first game together, in what is typically a rite of passage for father and son. And Aston Villa even took to Twitter to share their delight at seeing the avid young royal at the game. The club tweeted, you know how to pick your hashtag AVFC games, your royal highness. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge, both 37, couldn't hide their smiles as they joined their children to see Aston Villa race to a 4-0 score by halftime at the Canaries Stadium. Kate beamed as she patted her grinning son's knee as they joined hordes of fans to celebrate the team's 5-1 win against Norwich City. At one point, William and Kate appeared to try and gently calm Prince George as he wildly celebrated another goal. Although there was no sign of 17-month-old Prince Louis, Princess Charlotte giggled with delight as she soaked up the atmosphere alongside her older brother. The family appeared to take the time to chat to other Aston Villa supporters throughout the game as they watched from the back of the stands. And Prince George's exuberant display appeared to amuse those seated around around the royal family, who couldn't help but crack a smile as he jumped up and down and clapped his hands throughout the game. Gary Lineker even tweeted saying, think Prince George has caught the football bug early. Prince William is also an avid football fan and is a regular in the stands at Villa Park. He cheered the club to victory at Wembley last season. George's love of football has been no secret, and the little prince was even treated to a sports-themed party at Kensington Palace for his sixth birthday. According to Hello Magazine, Prince William, 37, and Kate Middleton, 37, hosted the after-school bash event ahead of the Little Royal's sixth birthday on 22 July. And the popular prince invited his whole class at Thomas Battersea to the football-themed occasion ahead of the end of term. The youngster has proved posed for his official birthday photographs in an England shirt, and was pictured chasing after a ball with his younger sister Princess Charlotte at a polo match earlier this year in July. It is believed the royal celebrated his birthday early so that he could enjoy an action-packed bash with his friends from school before the end of term. The Cambridge family is believed to have spent George's actual birthday, on 22nd of July, on the luxury island of Mystique. The news comes weeks after the little prince was seen beaming in his official birthday portraits wearing an England football shirt. He was also snapped playing football with his younger sister Charlotte while attending a charity polo match with his family. Prince William is an avid football fan, follower of Aston Villa and president of the Football Association FA. He took over the role of from his uncle, the Duke of York, in 2006 and has taken a keen interest in all aspects of the game, including his support of the men's and women's national teams. He previously spoke out about why he is a fan of the club, and told the BBC a 2015 interview, A long time ago at school I got into football big time. I was looking around for clubs. All my friends at school were either Man United fans or Chelsea fans and I didn't want to follow the run of the mill teams. I wanted to have a team that was more mid-table that could give me more emotional roller coaster moments. Aston Villa's always had a great history. I have got friends of mine who support Aston Villa and one of the first FA Cup games I went to was Bolton v Aston Villa back in 2000. Sadly, Villa went on to lose to Chelsea. It was fantastic, I sat with all the fans with my red beanie on, and I was sat with all the Brummie fans and had a great time. It was the atmosphere, the camaraderie and I really felt that there was something I could connect with. Prince George has been pictured celebrating Aston Villa's 5-1 win with his father William, mother Kate, and sister Charlotte in adorable pictures showing the close-knit family's fun day out. A gap-toothed George, 6, 
was seen grinning and laughing with the Duchess of Cambridge and Prince William as the Duke's team beat Norwich City at their Carrow Road Stadium today, amounting speculation that little boy is also a keen Villa fan. Although there was no sign of one-year-old Prince Louis, Princess Charlotte, four, looked on thoughtfully as fans cheered the team on toward a victory. George was sporting an Aston Villa t-shirt as he beamed when the team scored goal after goal. One image shows the youngster punching the air as he celebrates with his mother. The adorable display was seen by Gary Lineker. The TV presenter tweeted, Think Prince George has caused the football bug early. The official Aston Villa Twitter account also sent George warm wishes, and tweeted, You know how to pick your hashtag AVFC games, your royal highness. They added a winking emoji to the sweet message. William sported a royal blue v-neck jumper and matching shirt while the Duchess of Cambridge wore a brown jacket with her long hair down. The pictures come after William was spotted going wild in May when his club secured promotion to the Premier League through a championship playoff final. William has always worn his heart on his sleeve when it comes to his club allegiance and the Villa fan was watching on at Wembley in one of the upper boxes. The second in line to the throne was sitting nearby Villa legend John Carew, who he embraced joyously after the final whistle. Villa sealed their return to the Premier League after three years out with a 2-1 victory over Derby. The Duke of Cambridge revealed his nerves ahead of the pound 170 million match, telling BBC Sport, I'm incredibly excited. It is going to be a bit of a nervy affair for me. It proved exactly that up until the final whistle, with William peeping through his hands as the clock ticked down in the final minute. Prince William has supported Villa since his school days and revealed his strange geographical choice to Gary Lineker during a BBC interview at the 2015 FA Cup final. He explained, I was looking around for clubs. All my friends at school were either Man United fans or Chelsea fans and I didn't want to follow the run of the mill teams. I wanted to have a team that was more mid-table that could give me more emotional roller coaster moments. Aston Villa's always had a great history. I have got friends of mine who support Aston Villa and one of the first FA Cup games I went to was Bolton v Aston Villa back in 2000. Sadly, Villa went on to lose to Chelsea. It was fantastic, I sat with all the fans with my red beanie on, and I was sat with all the Brummie fans and had a great time. It was the atmosphere, the camaraderie and I really felt that there was something I could connect with. 